Hi, this is Rick here. I'm going to do a uh, demonstration on putting Yoroi into, uh, or putting a Daedalus wall into Yoroi so you can see how that's done. I'm just uh, giving it a moment to come up on YouTube. Looks like it's up and live. And I'm going to be putting a 15 word passphrase in. Um, so don't do that. That's not a good idea, but I'll be showing you on YouTube because I have test wallets uh, with just a small amount of ADA in them, so it's okay to do that. And looks good. It's on YouTube. I wanted to be able to see the chat. In case you have questions as I go along, you'll be able to ask me, and hopefully I'll be able to answer them, answer your questions as I go through this. Okay, yep, all right. I'm going to drop the link in the Telegram channel over Digital Fortress and then get started on that. Okay, all right. So, see a few people are dialing in, but I'm going to leave this video up. Although it's a live stream, I'm just going to leave it up for um, educational purposes and practice purposes and all that kind of stuff. So, let me get started on how to do it. How do you put a Daedalus 15-word passphrase in your own? It's pretty easy. You don't need this video. So, if you want to watch the video, that's fine. Um, but, and if you have questions, feel free to ask questions. I'm going to share my screen and go over to the other side here. So let me share this desktop. Okay. Uh, let's see. Did I share the right one? What am I sharing? The wrong one. Hold on. Let me stop share. Let me do that again. Share screen. Desktop 2. There we go. Okay. All right. Now let me see if that is showing up on YouTube correctly. Looks like it is. Yep, okay. All right, so <clears throat> here's how we send, here's how you get the Daedalus wallet. You go to staking.cardano.org, shown up here, and I'm going to uh, go to delegate your stake. It, it's the incentivized test net, and you have your options to download Daedalus or Yoroi. I'm going to go down to this section for Yoroi. Uh, first, I go down to this section called Delegate Your Stake. This is the front page. And then under Delegate Your Stake, I'm going to scroll down to here you have Daedalus, where you can install that. Uh, but the reason I'm doing this video is people are having problems with Daedalus, and I'm installing in Chrome. So I'm going to hit the Chrome, and that will take me to the ITN version of Yoroi. And notice it's a little different. It has the multicolored test, and it says testnet here on you're right. So the reason I'm doing this video is people are still having a lot of problems with Daedalus. So I want to make sure you can stake however you want. You're always a good option. Um, I think in the, when the next version of Daedalus is your, is released, then you'll be okay staking from Daedalus. Uh, but basically in the last couple of weeks, as Jormungandr went to 8.7 and 8.8, 8.9, the network is looking better. It still has a little bit more calibration to do, a little bit more tweaking on the network side. Then the next release of Daedalus, you'll probably see a lot better performance out of the wallet. Uh, but in the meantime, you want to be able to use your ROI, so that's what this video is for. So let me get on to that. So oh, I'm going to do it twice. You, you can put multiple wallets, but you have to have multiple accounts. I'm going to show you how to do that as well. So I'm on one account. I'm over here on my Digital Fortress account. I'm on the right web page, and I'm going to hit Add to Chrome for the Eroi testnet, Add Extension. Now, I have an existing Eroi here. This is a real-world mainnet Eroi, and you can see it just popped in the extension for testnet Eroi right here, and I'm going to use this extension by clicking on it. So I, then I click on it, and it goes to the Euro extension, connects to the Euro server, and here I go through the setup. And now I'm going to just hit continue. And you got to read all this stuff right here. I've already read it a couple of times. I can't remember it. I'm just going to kind of scroll through and hit agree and continue. Now I already have 12 words. I'm going to restore wallet, not create wallet, but restore wallet right here on the far right hand side. And what you got to use is your Daedalus Rewards Wallet 15-word passphrase that you already created. You have to use the 15-word Daedalus Rewards passphrase. I'm going to hit Restore Wallet uh, and you, or Paper, but I'm going to use the 15-word recovery phrase, and I'm going to call this wallet Beyonce. 
and I put in the recovery phrase here. Now, of course, don't show your re recovery phrase um, on the internet like I'm doing here. You're going to see the words. So if you can get, if you can capture these words and take the ADA before I finish the video, then yay! Isn't that fun? Okay. So give me a little bit of time to get this done though before you steal the words. Uh, let me finish my video first. Oh, that's not the right word. There we go. Notice it's the first four letters is all is is all you need. By the time you get to the fifth letter, you have a unique word. That's how the things work. Okay, so I got the green check mark. Now I put in the spending password. And restore the wallet. Uh, it gives you some details that you got to read here. Make sure the account checks on an icon match. Make sure to address match uh, what you remember. Yeah, right. Okay. Like I'm really going to do that. <sighs> okay, I wish I did, but I'm not going to remember it. Then I hit confirm. Um, now this page, it says, if you had any of your wallet prior to November 29th, so it gives you the dates. Now here's the important part. Do you want to check if, if your wallet needs to be upgraded or skip? Hit skip. Don't hit check. If you hit check, you might get an error. Hit skip and let the thing create the wallet. And uh, that will come up on your screen there. Um, any questions in chat? Hey, Phil Stevens, Chris Ray, how you doing, guys? This will generate the wallet. It'll generate one. Now with Euro, you can delegate with one wallet. A lot of people like to have two or more. The only way you can do two or more accounts is you have to have two or more Chrome logins. Or I haven't tried this yet, but like a Chrome that is not logged in with the Euro wallet and a Chrome that is logged in. I don't know if you can do not logged in anymore the way Google works, but you gotta have if you want two different Euro ITN wallets, you have to have two different Chrome logins to put it in or maybe you can put a, a copy of your OE, ITN your OE in Chrome and do a different one in Firefox so that it's a different instance the key is it has to be a separate instance of your OE for you to use it all right it looks like this wallet has generated itself it's restored it's got 8.4 ADA in it it's still continuing to restore if you do get the red banner at the top don't worry about it just hit Hit the refresh button All right there. So I've restored this Daedalus 15 word rewards wallet passphrase. Now I can delegate it. So go over to the delegation center um, and you, I'm going to search for love because it's uh, Valentine's Day coming up shortly. And where's that? Where is Papa Carp's love? It's one of these here. Oh, I need to hit search. So I hit search. I'm going to type in love and hit search. Because it's Valentine's Day coming up, February 14th. Don't you guys forget it. I know y'all, all y'all crypto geeks. There it is, Stake Love. And hit delegate. Okay. And this is allowing me to delegate to the pool love there. I'm going to put the spending password in. I did a simple one so I can type with one hand. Oops, I did it wrong though. Give me a moment. And hit delegate. You got to give it a moment. It has to send the transaction to the blockchain. It says successfully delegated. Then you hit dashboard page. This will also take uh, several seconds while it retrieves the blockchain data from the Emergo server that provides the Euroi data. So I hit dashboard page. Just give it a few minutes, maybe a minute or so. It has to, you know, it, the transaction for the delegation just went to the blockchain and the server has to process it, send it out to the nodes. The nodes have to reply to the server. And now I'm going to the delegation center and see how that goes. Um, well, this is going to go to delegation. I'm going to look at the dashboard. The dashboard is what I want to look at. Uh, this says delegation temporary disabled. I'm just going to go to the dashboard manually. 
And if your dashboard doesn't show your results right away, right away, just hit the refresh button up here on the web browser. Uh, if you ever get the red warning banner, don't worry about it. Just hit the refresh button, and it'll it'll reconnect in some short period of time. Uh, I'm gonna give us a moment to to show up. Looks like it's going, almost done. And then I'm gonna show you how to do a second wallet um, because a lot of people have more than one wallet, right? If you have Daedalus, see Daedalus will let you do, I think at least eight. It'll let you do eight wallets and eight different delegations. If my number's wrong, I apologize. I think that's what it'll do. But with Yoroi, you have to have a separate instance. Okay, there it goes. It's good to go. See, now it's delegated over here to Stake Love, all right? So any questions so far? Let me check the chat there. Hi, Gene Pasker. How you doing? Uh, Gene says, only use as many letters as possible and click the word. Yeah, that's right, Gene. So four letters when you're putting in the words, and it should be unique by that point. All right. That way, if you have a keystroke logger, it doesn't keep them all. But if you type in the first four letters, at that point, it's unique. Uh, Chris Ray asks, is there any plans coming from the Euro team to allow for two wallets in the same dashboard? Chris, I don't know the answer to that question. There's other questions are, can I log in, log out? You don't really log out of your row. You just took, close the tab that you opened it in, and it's basically logged out because the instance no is you know removed. Um, but you can't log in or out of Daedalus or Yoroi. But uh, it almost doesn't matter unless you're worried about other people seeing your balance. What's more important is that you have a spending password. That you can't, you know, that, that kind of goes without saying. Make sure you always set a spending password. And Yoroi, I think you have to. And Daedalus used to have an option not to. But um, every time I do it, I set a, pending, I set a, a spending password. All right, so let me do the second one. Get on to that. Any questions, please let me know in the chat. To do a second wallet, you got to have multiple logins. And i got multiple accounts on Chrome. Like, here's my uh, my regular login here. Then I have my Digital Fortress login for YouTube. You know, it's a Google a Google account. you got to have a separate Google account if you use Chrome. Uh, then i got Wade Wilson here. Wade Wilson is my troll account. So if you ever get something from Wade Wilson, that's me trolling you. Okay? Okay? That's Wade Wilson. Uh, if, if Wade's trolling you, and here's Cardano Effect, of course, I'm not going to say that. So we use Wade Wilson. I click on it. It opens up another instance. And now I'm going to go back to the staking.cardano.com. Uh, go to that web page. I'm going to copy this and then hop back over to wait. So you got to have more than one login. So I'm going to paste that in there. That'll take me to the delegation download center where I can scroll down to Yoroi Chrome and I'm going to download a second instance and see how it's not showing here now, right? So on this web browser, I have my real world Yoroi. I have my ITN Yoroi. And then here I don't have it. Then I hit add to Chrome. And it's installing another one. Hit add extension. And in it goes. Doesn't take very long. And boom. All set up. Now I can do a second wallet and delegate to a different pool. Okay. Uh, let's see. Yeah. All right. English and continue. I hope I clicked the right button. Sometimes I lose track of what I'm doing. Oops. Let me get the web browser where you can see it. Yeah. There we go. And hit continue again. And I'm going to restore a wallet. Remember, you got to use the 15-word passphrase or paper, but 15-word recovery phrase if you're recovering a Daedalus Rewards wallet. And I'm going to call this one Rihanna. And I'm going to put in the passphrase for that one. Watch, someone probably grabbed the other one. Remember, February 14th, Valentine's Day. Don't forget it. Bunch of dudes in crypto. You're going to screw it up. Just kidding. All right, so let me put these words in. Remember, never show your real wallet seeds on and to anyone. See how it gets unique after the fourth letter? Some of them are three letter words. I must have made a mistake. Maybe not. Hold on. One word left. <laughs> I don't have any left on my paper. Oh my gosh. I hope I didn't screw this up. Maybe I just missed a word. Let me do it more carefully. 
That's the problem with doing a live stream. Screw-ups. They're permanent. Yay, green check mark. Hopefully I got the right ones in there. Okay. Okay. And again, the verify restored wallet information. Make sure you read over that. And again, hit skip. Don't hit check. If you hit check, it might error out. Probably going to error out. You can hit check. But this, you're restoring a Daedalus Rewards Vault, so you actually already already verified it. Um, sometimes a check works, some, a lot of times you'll get an error. If you do get an error, just exit out and do it over again, you'll be fine. Okay, so this is going to restore the second wallet. That way I have two different wallets, similar to Daedalus, and I can delegate to different stake pools. Any questions, let me know in the chat. I'm almost done. I'm going to punch out uh, shortly after I'm done with this. And see if I can get my ADA back before somebody else does. But if you do, then haha, that's pretty funny. Good job. <laughs> okay, so here I am in my second wallet. And I can go to uh, delegation now. And I can get another pool. Now before I searched for a pool. Or I can do random and just let it. Oh, there's better late than never. Mark Stopka's pool. So I'll delegate to that one. You're always, you're always doing pretty well. It's working pretty good. There it is. And then the spending password. Oops. And hit delegate. And off it goes. Dashboard page. Successfully delegated. And now I've got two wallets in Yoroi. But you got to have that separate account. You see, I've got different accounts here. It'll just take a moment before it gets over to the dashboard page. So here's the first wallet. Here's the first wallet that I made. The Yoroi. And the balance is still there. Yay. <laughs> maybe, I'll, maybe I'll get it back when I'm done with the video. And then the delegation center, I can go redelegate. Uh, when you redelegate, there's two ways of doing it. You can either undelegate, which costs 0.8 ADA. Or you simply redelegate, which also costs 0.88. But if you undelegate and redelegate, it's going to cost you 1.6. So it's better to pick a pool you want and then just go straight to it. Okay. So here's one wallet that's delegated to Stake Love. And here's another wallet that's delegated to Better Late Than Never. Uh, or it'll show up here. It, it'll show up in this dashboard once that comes up. Okay. All right, so uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to give it a moment. Come on, show up. Won't take long. There it is. Yay. All right, so here I have two wallets, one delegated better late than never. And if you want more, you just simply make more accounts. You know, it's easy to make an email address nowadays, but you'd have to make multiple Google accounts. So there's one to stake love and one to better late than never. And that's how you do it. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching Digital Fortress. And don't forget about Valentine's Day. I've said that a couple times now. Remember that. February 14th. Don't forget. All right, y'all. No questions. I'm going to punch out. Y'all have a good evening. Take care. Bye-bye.